Hello, everyone. Welcome to our new podcast about wealth management. My name is Amit Chopra from Refinitiv, and I have the privilege to have Mr. Mukarram Matasi today, the Head of Investment Management from the National Bank of Fajera. Good morning, Amit. <laughs> Good morning. It's not every day that we get uh, a brain like Mukarram to come and speak to us about managing our money, our wealth, our retirement, our children's education and savings. Um, there's a lot that we have to go through today, so I'm going to get right into it. Uh, Mukarram, thank you very much for joining us. Thank you, Amit. Um, I want to set the scene for everybody about this conversation and uh, there are a lot of numbers that go around in terms of research that people have done about how many people in the UAE are actually planning for their retirement. Uh, it's almost shocking uh, to say the least uh, to see some of the figures that have come out from a YouGov survey that we had read earlier. It shows that almost half of the population over here is not planning for their retirement in terms of finances. Do you want to say something about that or you know, how, do, how does NBF feel about it? It's all about planning early and the importance of planning early. So let me ask you a very obvious question. Yes. Um, why do I need to plan for my retirement? So the planning process is important for every individual to, to, to think about and to try and see the big picture. What are the milestones in my uh, life cycle sure. that will require certain, uh, certain amounts of money that I need to keep aside in order to, to fend off any potential surprises? Okay, so I understand that we all need to plan. More than half of us are not yes. uh, planning in the UAE to uh, retire over here. What, in your experience, have you seen are the pitfalls of not planning? You must have had a lot of experiences or people that you've spoken to uh, that have left it too late or not done yeah. it at all. Uh, you, one, you don't reach financial independence early. You will need to keep on working. Uh, so when you, for instance, everyone has an idea, a rough idea, of when they would want to, to, to retire. Some say 55, some say 60, some say 65. But often we see for those who did not set aside and did not plan accordingly, that they will need to prolong their, their retirement age. They haven't invested uh, you know, sufficiently to have a cushion to finance their retirement. Interesting. So, on average, how long do I need to plan for? The earlier you start, the better. Obviously, when you are buying assets, right, you need the compounding effect to kick in. So the earlier you start, the better it is. That's really um, sort of enlightening to understand uh, you know, how much time we actually require to retire. I want to go on further in the next episode and we want to talk about goal setting mm -hmm. um, and sort of get into a little bit more detail. Mm -hmm. But thank you very much for talking thank to you. us today and we'll, we'll speak again in the next episode. Okay. Cheers.